In this lesson, we'll deal with the flight control power sources and the switch functions for the servo controls, which are located on the overhead panel above the hydraulic power controls. All primary and secondary flight control surfaces are moved by servo controls. These servo controls are supplied by one of three independent hydraulic systems. As you work your way through this topic, it's not necessary for you to memorize which hydraulic system supplies power to which flight control surface. This information can be found in the Hydraulic Power Distribution Table in your Quick Reference Handbook, QRH. Select each group of control surfaces in turn to find out more details. When you're ready, select the topic icon to move on. The Kruger flaps, as well as the aileron droop, are powered by the green hydraulic system only. The slats are controlled by two independent systems, which are supplied by the blue and green hydraulic systems. The flaps are controlled by two independent systems, which are supplied by the green and yellow hydraulic systems. The elevators, being one of the more critical primary flight control surfaces, are powered by the three hydraulic systems. There are seven spoilers on each upper wing surface as follows. The roll function utilizes the five outer spoilers, three to seven. The speed brake function utilizes the four inner spoilers, one to four. The ground spoilers function utilizes all spoilers, one to seven. Each surface servo valve is supplied by one of the three hydraulic systems as shown in the hydraulic power distribution table in the QRH. The ailerons, being one of the more critical primary flight control surfaces, are powered by the three hydraulic systems. The stabilizer is supplied by the green and yellow hydraulic supplies. With the servo control push buttons in their normal configuration, hydraulic power is supplied to the flight controls as soon as pressure is available in the hydraulic systems. If the supply pressure is low, or the servo control push buttons are set to off, the hydraulic power supply is stopped, and the low pressure legend confirms the system state. Here, the blue and yellow servo control valves have been switched off, and the guard on the push button has been raised for you. Set the green servo control push button to off. Setting all three systems to off results in the reactivation of all systems. This prevents the accidental loss of all flight controls.